Hey everyone, going out tonight, so I thought I'd do my uh, makeup uh, video for you while I'm doing that. And um, I'll be using today uh, unique products and um, reviewing them for you so you can see what they're like in the flesh. And um, I'll crack on with it. Okay, so I've already put moisturiser and a bit of primer on and um, I'm going to use a unique foundation and this is a liquid foundation, Mineral Touch. And um, if you're a bit frightened about buying online um, makeup, um, they're, the girls that sell it are really good at what they do. They know um, how to recommend the right tone for your skin. They'll ask you a few questions, maybe get you to send in a picture of your face with no, no makeup on in natural light. And um, my friend Nicola's selling this and she got me the perfect colour. This is organza. So this is good for me. I'm quite pale um with um I think you have to look at the color in your veins and to figure out what sort of it's all very clever but I don't know how they do it but it's great yeah so this is the mineral touch foundation it is liquid so the best thing to do is give it a good shake before you put it on and then you can either apply it to a brush or apply it straight to your skin um I put a few dobs on my skin like so and then blend it in and then you always got some on the actual sink so I normally wipe that on my skin as well make the most of it so a little goes quite a long way um, it is liquid so um, takes a little bit of blending in um, but it's great um, these aren't unique products, but I'm just going to say, if you can get anyone anything for Christmas, these are amazing. These um, When they first come out, they look like spoons. And I was like, why are people rubbing spoons all over their faces? I was really confused. Um, and they were really expensive, but these are just off of um, Amazon, a lot cheaper. But they're still so soft and smooth. They feel like rubbing um, velvet all over your face. This is great for um, applying your foundation. And oh, it feels so smooth. And this liquid foundation is a liquid, but it dries to like a powder finish. So it's not greasy at all. It's really lovely. And like I say, the girls are really good at um, telling you what colour you will need for your skin. And it gives a really good coverage. I mean, if you want to you know more of a coverage you just add a little bit more but I think this is a it, you know I say a little goes a long way it's really good and then sometimes I just go around the uh, cracks just to fill it in but it's a really lovely sheer finish um not very good light in here sorry so it's really lovely colour and um, yeah I'm happy with that one so that's organza that's my colour um, then I have the moon struck addiction palette and my one is number five now there's a few of them and they're really lovely shades but I've gone for the bit more vibrant ones so you've got like a pink purple a red uh, a really lovely copper like we're burnt orange copper a gold and a silver so they are really pretty shine them in the light there and some of them they're quite highly pigmented so in the light it kind of changes a little bit of color and they're really really lovely so what i'm going to do first is just going to put a bit of concealer on both of my eyelids and um this just gives any makeup a really good base covers up all your veiny bits and everything in your um, eyelid so you've got a nice clean slate to put your beautiful pretty eyeshadows on so that's that you have to excuse me my nose keeps running <laughs> I think it's so warm in here <laughs> hopefully it doesn't ruin all of my makeup might have to go over that again okay so I think I'm going to go with the pinky purpley colours. Um, 
maybe a bit of gold in there just to set it off. So I'm going to start with a fluffy rounded brush and I'm going to go in with the pink which is called Victorious. And I'm going to go start at the corner in the crease, come right over and just keep rubbing it in. This actually has a lovely little mirror on it as well. So that's quite good um, to get in an up close shot. Not always um, easy to do your makeup in a video um, into your phone screen. So that is the pink. I'll do that on the other side. But um, they go on lovely and they last really well. And they're buildable as well. So, the, you know more you put on the vibrant more vibrant it is but uh, to be honest I don't think you really need a lot um you know they're really good color they don't sort of need like going over and over and over as you can see that's just one you know one go of me just spreading it about so that's quite a high coverage um I just like to blend quite a lot so that's probably why I'm not really adding any more to my brush then I'm going to go in with a purple, which is fearless. So I'm going to be victorious and fearless tonight. Uh, sounds rather good. Maybe not so much at the end of the night, but we'll see. Uh, and I'm just going to go right in the corner with the purple. And just stay in the corner. Just underneath the pink slightly. To get a little bit darker in the corner area and then the other side um, and then you just see you just blend it in get the smoky pinky purpley colour really pretty I'm just gonna brush a little bit off of the brush and then blend that through In the daylight for you. Pinky purpley. Very pretty. And then just gonna go a little bit darker here. A bit more. And then brush that off. And then I think I'll go with the silver actually. The silver, which is brilliant. And I'm just going to go in the corner, my eye here. Just put a, a slightly lighter colour here, just makes your eyes pop open a little bit and doesn't close them too much, especially if you've got a darker here. Um, close your eye down a little bit too much. I always think I look like a, well, a clown until I put my mascara on because I have really fair eyelashes. Um, so it will all come together, trust me. Look a bit silly at the moment, but once the mascara is on, but that's because just because I've got really fair eyelashes. So what I'm doing is just taking a bit here. Just, as you see, that really makes my eyes pop open and just blend into the corner a little bit. Not all the way across, just sort of halfway. And then brush all that off on your hand again. And then just blend that up through, just to blend out the edges really. So you haven't got a harsh line. And I'm just gonna put a little bit of the pink again, but I'm gonna rub it in on my hand so it's very light, just to blend out up here to give me a little bit of color, but not too much. I want the, all the colour to be here really and then you can just keep adding to it you can see my glass of wine up there <laughs> <laughs> I'm giving away all my secrets I'm just going to come up a little bit higher with the pink on this side and I'm going to show it up a little bit more like so 
and then need some mascara. I'm going to use my uh, palette again because it's got a very good mirror on it. And this isn't um, a mascara from Unique, but um, believe me, I will be stocking up on lots more of their products because I think they're really good. I think everyone's a bit dubious at first because, you know, when you're buying stuff online, you can't really see the colour, you can't match it to your skin tone. But like I say, um, you know, these girls know what they're talking about. I say girls, there, must, there might be guys still in it. I don't want to uh, offend anybody. Um, and, um, yeah, they'll give you really good pointers. And even the website's pretty good um, for showing you what shades you should buy and stuff like that. And very um, good at telling you what all the ingredients is and everything like that. So if there's anything you're allergic to. And, you know, if you're not happy, um, you can send it back and get your money back. They're totally... Um, set on you know thinking that the products are, are really good and if you're not happy then you can send it back and get a full refund so at the end of the video i will put um down details of where you can buy this as you can see i don't look like such a clown anymore now my mascara is on and uh really pretty eyeshadow I'm a bit flush because I'm having a bit of a hot flush, but so that's nothing to do with makeup. Um, lo loads of mascara. They do a really good 3D mascara, which has fibre lashes in it. So um, you apply a mascara and then you put um, fibres over the top, um, which will probably be my next purchase. So you get super long lashes. But um, there you go. That's my... Um, Add a little bit of blusher stuff to my um, cheeks, but as you can see, that's my pretty look for the night. Pinky purpley, my hair's a bit pinky purpley at the moment, so I thought that would go. And um, I hope that helps anyone um, maybe think of ideas of what to use their palette with. So that was. Um, Moonstruck Addiction Palette in 5 and the Unique uh, Mineral Touch Liquid Foundation which uh, is lovely and feels really soft and smooth um, oh one last thing I can't forget this this is my Splash Lipstick from Unique and these are matte uh, matte lip glosses and I, you know I love my matte lip glosses these come with a really nice edged um, brush so you can get right into your lips. This is a lovely purple colour in uh, Superstitious, I think. Um, I'm going to forget the name. Sorry, Spellbound. Um, a bit Halloween-y. But let me show you this. Quite hard to talk when doing lipstick, so bear with me. goes on really easy it's like a mousse and so lovely to get the upper lip with this brush just the right shape you see a little goes a long way again and See that beautiful, you know, and it's a matte lips that you can rub your lips together without them getting all stuck and having bits everywhere, which is uh, lovely, and it, which can be a pain with some matte lip glosses. So you see that colour? Beautiful purple colour. So there you go. That's my unique makeup look, and um, yeah, I'll leave details below if you want uh, to buy any of this. Um, I'm not selling this, I'm just saying, you know, I'm just giving my review on it. And um, yeah, I hope you like that video. Please subscribe to my channel, give me some likes. And um, thanks everyone for watching. Bye.